look closely at Angel's hearings. From now on, they will be referred to as Exhibit A. I believe you found one of them at the murder scene. How do you know what we found? Uh, by playing detective. Detective. Inspector. Congratulations. I'll send fruit. I gave those earrings to Angel after one particularly charming night. Thanks for sharing that with us. We're merely trying to help all the facts float to the surface. You know where to find me. Yeah, under a rock. Can you believe that clump of blossom? I believe this earring. Can't you smell it? Somebody's trying to stick it to Angel. So what else is new? Chief, you gotta give me 24 hours to prove Angel's not guilty. I don't gotta do nothing. We've got a file full of blueprints, and now this earring. But I have new evidence. Grains of sand. Prints on, uh, grains of sand. A 52-year-old female, tall brunette, slightly overweight, green dress with puce buttons. Now it's a 55-year-old, slightly overweight police chief who has a tendency to be cranky. As far as I'm concerned, we've hooked our fish. Now reel her in. But now! Investigation of yours is stowing up quite a tidal wave. Really? What is the scoop from the bottom of the food chain? Boy, it is Angel Pinkdom. I thought I smelled a cop in here. I can't watch this. Fine. No one's ever said that to me before. Are you here to arrest me? Well, it's hard to argue with an earring that fits like a glove. So? I misplaced a trinket. It's not what you misplaced. It's where you misplaced it. Let's not talk here. There's a booth in the back, in the corner, in the dark. Go. I may have a voice husky enough to pull a dog sled, but I didn't kill clams. I swear it. Is this a snow job, Angel? I thought we were friends. We are, but I can't help you if you tie my fins. You used to like that. She's kidding. Sometimes a carp's got to do what a carp's got to do, but a carp don't got to like it. Angel, is crime boss Calamari involved with you in this? Gil, I'm not bad. I just smell that way. Sandy, unless I can find the fish that made those prints... I'm afraid that Angel's looking at 30 years of license plates, dishpan fins, and cellmates named Big Marge and Little Spike. I tossed, I turned, tormented. It was terrible. Talk about torture. Angel spoke 18 languages and couldn't say no in any of them. I needed to find some answers. So I contacted all my usual snitches. What do you hear about Angel in the Clans Casino? And some of my unusual snitches. So, oh, this is a cop that's carrying. No, the herring's not good. No, I, I didn't, didn't say herring. I said carrying. What's the matter with you? Don't you say herring. Say? You didn't say Listen, herring. Listen, right, the last time you Every day you tell me something. I'll give you an agent. Mm -hmm. What's about the herring? The 
Widow Casino. Of course. Goldie, Goldie, Goldie. See, I'm a booking on a psychic. When I hear something from the seahorse's mouth, I like to pass it on to my best customer. Louie, the last time I trusted the sure thing, I ended up with a condo in Atlantis that I still can't find. Tad, do I we have a file on the Widow Casino? casino? Tall, Tall brunette, white hair, green blue dress, suit, no buttons, buttons, right? Wrong, uh, sir. But she is female. I knew it. Room 407, please. Yeah, I'll hold. Oh, by the way, Pearl called. Pearl? Huh? You remember Pearl, the one you haven't married yet? Oh, look who's talking. Why don't you take the plunge again? Oh, honey, after the fifth Mr. Right, I just can't say, no, really, it was great with a straight face anymore. Yeah, I'm still here. Thanks. Hello? Our deal's off. <laughs> you can't do this, Calamari. Oh, but I'm afraid I can. Well, you, you won't get away with it. I'll talk. You'll come get me? Goodbye, Mrs. Casino. Do keep in touch. <coughs> yes, I knew it. I knew it. Angel didn't do it. Well, at least not in the last 20 minutes. Go check the doors and bring me another espresso. It isn't the Widow Casino. Oh, I should have known you couldn't be trusted. Don't you think it's a little late for that? Late? Tardy, maybe. My husband is late. Yes, my ex-partner is pushing up seaweed. Thank you. Thank you? I kill my husband and that's it? Thank you? I apologize. I thought a ticket tape parade seemed like the whole kill. You set me up. Oh, really? I merely mentioned in passing that your husband and Angel were seeing entirely too much of each other. You're the one who pulled the trigger, my dear. My tentacles are clean. Oh, no. No, no. You're not getting off that easy. I want my husband's half of the shell shack. Oh, what's this ocean coming to when there's no honor among lowlifes? <laughs> Then you must be the one who promised to love, honor, and oblige in your husband. For 20 years, I went to that jail. I made an Argyle scarf. I made Danish. All Angel ever made was him. My dear widow Casino, in about two seconds, a large brown creature with shoulders in two different time zones will be coming around the corner with my espresso. Tisk, tisk. Calamari, don't you know? Caffeine is bad for your health. Damn, I hate risking my life for an unevolved species. <laughs> Didn't you just fall out the window? Yeah. Luckily, your car broke my fall. Ah, uh, thanks, kid. No thanks necessary, uh, sir. I find myself in the unappetizing position of having to thank you. Save it. I know you were in on all this, but one day, you're gonna slip up and I'll be there. Gosh, boss, the water thing. Thank you for believing I was innocent. Hey, I never believed you were innocent, Angel. I just knew you weren't guilty. I merely baited a hook. I'm just glad the Widow Casino took it. And I'm glad I got my job back. I've been wondering about that. I know it's hard to understand, Gil, but Calamari is my friend. Maybe you'd better look for some new friends. Mm. Thanks. Well, this is where I... Get on. 
Angel, I've been trying to convince these folks all night long. We're just friends, pals, buddies, amigos. I mean, we're here, my apartment. I knew that. Well, good night, friend. Good night, Angel. But, Gil, if you're ever up for buying a ticket, my box office is always open. Sorry. Sometimes I just can't help myself. I felt good about putting the Widow Casino in jail. I felt better about getting Angel out of jail. I felt bad about not grabbing Calamari. I felt worse about not grabbing Angel. I had a lot of feelings about a lot of things. I don't know what it is about females and murder. They just seem to get into bed together. At least that's been my experience. 